Hey guys, it's me, and I'm back with another plan with me, which has been a long time coming because I haven't filmed one in quite some time. So this kit I am using is a, from Lilies and Lore. So I'm showing you the date covers, washi strips, um, your more functional sheet with your sidebars and your quarter boxes, icons and stuff. Then you have your hat boxes, some checklists and some icons and your weekend banner. Then you have your headers and your little things and you have your checklists and then you have your full box. And I recently showed this one in my haul as well so there's that. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and start planning. So first I'm going to go ahead and put my large washi strip down at the bottom. Um, and you see I like to put it down at the very bottom and that leaves me some space to put some of my hydrate stickers on top of it. You'll see what I do there. I'm putting my hydrate stickers from Simply Ginger Po and then I'm putting it on top of the washi strip so it doesn't take up a lot of space in my planner throughout the day. Um, and then next I'm going to go ahead and work on my sidebar. So, I put the energy flows where intention goes full box and where they say full thought box goes. And then I went ahead and stacked three habit trackers on the side. So the glossy ones are from Happy Cloud Ink and then the darker purple one is from Wild Sunshine Co. And I got it from a, like a deluxe sampler. So it came in handy because it matches the purples and I actually ran out of purples from Happy Cloud Ink. So. I was really happy to put that in there so I wanted to track my supplement intake and track um, checking my school stuff and I also wanted to put a habit tracker down for no spending on stickers this week until I get through the weeks. Um, the pen I am using is from Michaels. I'm using the Pigma Micron and for me I think it's similar to the Statler Fineliner and it writes really smoothly for me. So moving on back to my planning, I went ahead and put a little things with a star on it and put spending on it as a header. And then I went ahead and put the weekly or the stackable sidebars that came in the kit um, on the sidebar as well. Sorry, I'm really not thinking today. Um, then I went ahead and put the date covers on the top and went ahead and also put my to-do headers there as well. And now I'm going to go ahead and start planning Monday. So on Monday I don't really have a lot of things planned besides the fact that it's Labor Day. I want to take some time for myself. So first off I started off with some of the to-dos I wanted to do on Monday before school starts on Tuesday. So I'm running a couple of things down, moving some of my post-it notes around because that's how I pre-plan. Then I put down a two-day header and I put down a half box to write down that my best friend comes back from Korea that day. So that's really exciting. I'm so happy that she's coming back. Um, and then I went ahead and let's see what I'm trying to do here. <laughs> um, oh, I started filling in her name. And if you guys notice my nails, I actually finally got them done after like months because I'm not really that type of person that like paints her nails so often. It's more like a pampering kind of thing. So I finally got that done when I went to Victoria. So again, and I noticed that it kind of matches my planner right now too, like the spread, how it's all purple and stuff. So that's really cool um, and then I laid down some washi strips to layer on top of this me time sticker and then at the very bottom I want to set aside some time so I can take a nice hot bath to really like let the reality sink in that school starting on Tuesday so there's that um, and then I went ahead on Tuesday and put down another full box checklist and the only thing I wanted to do on Tuesday was to call my agency because as some of you guys may have known, uh, she filmed a movie a couple weeks ago and I'm just waiting for that call so I can go ahead and pick up my paycheck. And then I went ahead and 
started putting in the rest of the headers down as well as this checklist that I've actually pulled up and then I realized it wasn't like the right color on one thing and then it wasn't sticking on the page well or the sticker page well so I went ahead and put it on Thursday and I took a full box and layered on a half box because um, my school has this thing called Imagine Day which is like orientation and that was going to be taking up a majority of the day so I wanted to write that down, um, block off that chunk of time because I believe it's from 9 to 5 it does take a lot of time out of my day so I wanted to write that down then I wanted to write down the Bachelor in Paradise this I believe on Tuesday and Wednesday I've been so far behind on the Bachelor in Paradise like it's unbelievable so no spoilers please I'm trying to catch up really fast I'm just like waiting for my boyfriend to watch it with me because he watches it with me and he hasn't had time to watch it so I'm just waiting on him so next I am writing down my little things and I'm writing them all in advance so I wrote down that I have to wear my retainer and then the three TV shows that I plan on watching where I don't plan on watching them all on Wednesday because that would be overkill but the three TV shows that would be on that day rather than the two that I normally watch then on Wednesday is actually going to be the first day of classes so I want to write down the class schedule that I have so um, on Wednesday my school fees are due so I wanted to write that down to remind myself to pay my school fees and then I'm taking these like pencil stickers from Once More With Love and writing down my class name on it as well as the time and the building it's in. And I just wanted to mention that because school is starting this week and this is a spread where I kind of show my, my school week, I'm, I'm wanting to say that because school is starting, I'm obviously not going to have a lot of time to film planning videos or planner videos in general. Um, just because I want to focus a lot on school. So I hope you guys understand. I'll try to record as much as I can, but my priority is to school and focus on school. So next I'm going to go ahead and put down the rest of the full box checklists and I actually really like these full box checklists that Lily's and Moore actually has. I think they are really unique. Um, they kind of remind me of the Coffee Monsters Co with a little twist so that's why I like them and also putting down the rest of the two-day headers as well. So after I put down the, the today headers, I went ahead and wrote down that garbage day is on Thursday and I put it on a little appointment label and put the garbage icon that came in the kit um, and I put it on the appointment label as well and then I am writing down that big brother is on Thursday as well so I don't miss that, remind myself and then I went ahead and started filling in things in my to-do list and also putting down the class names again on my planner so a bunch of it's just going to be repetitive, repetitive I'm just going to be putting down the classes I have for that day and stuff like that so I'm just going to let you go ahead and watch that. <music> on Sunday um, and I actually wanted to get that done before school started but they couldn't squeeze me in on time so 
I guess I'll have to pamper myself after suffering through the first week of school. Um, so it's on Sunday, but then I realized that I didn't put down my weekend banner yet. So I wanted to put down some washi strips to layer on, on top of my weekend banner. <music> Taking another appointment label, I put a camera icon to hopefully get around to recording, recording and editing another Plan With Me video, if possible, maybe, hopefully, I don't know. Um, just depending on how heavy my course load is, we will have to see. And I went ahead and layered that on top of some washi strips. Now on Saturday, I don't have anything planned besides a lazy day to kind of like regain my energy from that crazy hectic first week of school. Um, so that's why I went ahead and did that. Um, then going ahead and I put some balloons next to Imagine Day because it's not really a first week of school. It's kind of like a celebration and a welcoming. So it's like a huge day at school i don't really know um yeah but i put some balloons there to kind of decorate it and then i went ahead and filled in the dates for my date covers and now i am going to um fill in tuesday remind myself that it's payday on tuesday and i'm so sorry that this found me is like all over the place i kind of just like randomly sporadically like think of things to fill in and i'm also really sorry that my plan is out of frame i don't have a viewfinder on my phone like i can't see what i'm doing so i just kind of like go by whatever i see and also i plan with my planner like really close to me so i don't even realize that my plan is out of frame so hopefully the next video will be better but i'm sorry for that if you can wanted to see what I was doing but I'm basically putting down my little things on Sunday and now here I am kind of taking a glance of my planner kind of figuring out if I need to fill anything else and then I'm gonna go over the sheets that come in the kit and kind of see if I really need to use up more things and then I realized that there was a decorative sheet that I wanted to use up so here I am filling up the space at the bottom and just putting the decorative stickers all around so you can see what my planning thought is when I am sticking my decorative stickers around my planner so there's that so I hope you guys enjoyed watching this plan with me I'm just gonna end it here if you guys liked it please like and subscribe and hopefully I'll see you in another video soon as always I hope you guys have a great day